Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullah. Bonjour les enfants. Bonjour. 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 Comment ça va? Ça va bien. Merci. Are you ready for today's lesson? Yes. Do you remember what day we are today? Oui. Where is Judy? Do you remember? Jeudi. Okay. Jeudi. Jeudi. Jeudi 16 avril. Répétez. Jeudi. Jeudi 16 avril. Aujourd'hui, on va apprendre la leçon 4. We will learn lesson 4. It's a word called l'impératif. What is the name of our lesson? Impératif. Impératif. I want you to be quiet and to listen to me. Okay? Okay. Yeah, let me see. Now, I think some girls are still writing on the board and girls, really, this is not nice. Okay, you are big girls, mashallah. So please stop playing, okay? Again, I'll end the meeting. Okay, now, yalla, let's, let's uh, take our lesson today. Bismillah. Unité 6, leçon 4, l'impératif. Now, l'impératif, in English, we call it the imperative. It is used to express an order, a request, an advice, and a prohibition. What is the meaning of this? In English, imperative is imperative. It means we are making an order. Open your door. Keep quiet. Close uh, the window. So we can also use it to make an advice. Be a good girl. Uh, listen to your mom. And also a prohibition. What is the prohibition? A prohibition means to tell someone not to do something. Not to do something. Uh, don't uh, don't eat uh, Mama, don't eat this music, uh, loudly. Mama, I have to start French. I'm trying to speak. Uh, please, girls. Huh? Yes. I have to French. Be, be quiet. Don't talk loudly when the teacher is explaining. So here, this we call it a prohibition. It means to tell you not to do something. To tell you not to do something. Okay. Till here, everything is clear? Yeah? Yes. Okay. Yes, yes. Now, let's see here the next page. Now, let's see here some examples and see how we will make it. Now, first, we have to conjugate the verb in the present tense with only three subject pronouns, tu, nous, and vous. Then we have to remove the pronoun. Let's see here with the pronouns, with the verbs of first group. What do we know about the verbs of first group? They all end with er, like here, verbe parler. Now, do you see here verbe parler? Yes. So here, verbe parler and with er. See here in the picture here, verbe parler and with er. What did I do here to conjugate this verb à l'impératif in the imperative? How can I use verbe parler to make an order? Verbe parler means to talk or to speak. So the first step is that I cross the ER. Then I put the verb with tu. It will be tu parles. I will add ES. Nous parlons. I will add ONS. And vous parlez. I will add EZ. Then after this, what I will make? After this, I will cross the 
S only. And cross to the pronoun. Cross nu and cross vu. Now, tu, nu, and vu are called pronouns. Tu, nu, and vu are called pronouns. We remove the pronouns. In English, do you say you close the window or do you say close the window? You open your book or open your book? We don't use a open your book. pronoun. We don't use a subject pronoun. Okay? And also here, we don't use the subject pronoun. Here also, we have to cross the subject pronoun. So it will be parle, speak, parlant, let's speak, parler, speak, all of you. So what is the difference between parlant and parler? Now here, uh, when I say parlant, it means I am included with you. It means I will make the action with you. I will speak with you. But here, when I say parler, it means you only have to speak. Only you, you have to speak. So now, again, I will explain again. Now, first step here, we have to cross the ER from the verb. Here, parler, we cross the ER. Then I will conjugate the verb with three subject pronouns only. Tu, nous, and vous. With tu, I add ES to the verb. Tu, parle. With nous, it will be parlant. O and S at the end. And vous, E, Z at the end end of the verb here then what i will make i'll cross the subject pronoun it will be and also i will cross the s so when the person is to when the subject pronoun is to i cross to and i cross the s so if the verb will end only with e it will be parle speak and with no i don't put no i cross no and i put o n s and with vu, I put ez to the verb. So it will be parler. So here, parle, parlant, parler. And again, I'm saying that the difference between parle, that I'm talking to one person only. And if I am saying parlant, it means I am with you i am included with you let's play football let's uh, speak english let's speak french let's learn uh, science it means that i will learn with you and when i tell you parler it means you will speak and i will not speak this is the difference between the three uh, uh, persons okay so now let's see here the next slide. Verb aller à l'impératif. So we will take only one irregular verb in this lesson. It's verb aller. Now, Madame, verb aller is ending with er. You said that the verbs that end with er. We call them les verbes du premier groupe. Why verb aller doesn't belong to this group? Because here, the, it's an irregular verb. And here, verb aller with tu is va. So uh, it's changed completely. I didn't put the es as I make with the premier group. So here, verb aller will be va. It means go. When I'm talking to one person, va à ta place, go to your place. Allons means let's go. Uh, allons au zoo. It means let's go to the zoo. I will go with you to the zoo. Allez, it means go. Only you. I'm talking to many persons now. Allez à la maison. Go home. Allez à l'école. Go to school. 
So, Ale, when I'm talking to many persons, to more than one person. Va, when I'm talking to only one person. Allons, let's go, when I'm included with you in the action. I will go with you. Now, I hope the lesson is clear. And let's now start answering the questions. I hope you are ready. Bismillah. Now, I will call your name, so get ready, my sweet girls. Now, I want, uh, I will. Yes, Aya, bonjour Aya. Bonjour. Now, I want you to answer the first one, Aya. Now, travailler. With which person? With who? Now, what I will make the first step, yeah, Aya? Cross the ER. Excellent. Cross the ER. Then, what I will put? E easy. Easy. Excellent, Aya. Bravo. So here, this is the answer. I want you to write the answers with me. Travailler bien. Work well. Travailler bien means work well. Très bien. Excellent, Aya. After you finish answering, you can mute yourself or I will mute you. It's okay. Now, Daline. Bonjour, Daline. Bonjour. Now, we have here verbe fermé means close. Fermé with which person? With tu. Fermé la porte. Close the door. So what I will make, what will be the first step, Daline? Close the ER. Très bien, excellent. Then what you will put? Only um, one letter. What is this letter? E. E, très bien. So it will be here. Ferme la porte. Close the door. Excellent. Now let's see here. Fatima Mohammed. Fatima? Yes. Yes, my dear. Verb aller. We said that verb aller is a regular verb or an irregular verb? Fatima? Fatima, my dear. Yes, teacher. Yes. Fatima, verb aller is a regular verb or irregular? Irregular. Irregular. So, verb aller with no, how it will be? Hmm. One second. Yes. Non avant? No. Check. Check in the book how we said that we will make verb aller with no. I don't have my book. You don't have your book. Okay. It is there in the school. You can take it from Mr. Muhammad. But I explained that. Tab. If I told you that here, verb aller will follow the same rule with no and vu. So, with no, what I put at the end of the verb? I cross the ER and put what? Easy. With no, we put easy. Fatima, you were not paying attention. No. Mm. Type, I will try here. Uh, Joyria. Joyria, one moment. Where is Joyria? Where did she go? I'll try here. Okay, Salma. Salma, her name. Okay, I'm yes. here. Salma, tell me. Uh, we put with no O and S. Très bien, O and S. It's not necessary that you have your book, girls. I just explained the lesson. So you can take some notes. You can write some notes and see what is the important thing that Madame Dina explained and write it until I send you the video okay so excellent okay. and fatima i will get back to you you have to answer and try one more time inshallah so it will be here allons à l'école i have put o n s allons à l'école now here let's see here uh, nurallah you can raise your hands girls if you want to answer but i will choose inshallah all of you don't worry so here uh, bonjour, Noor, comment ça va? Très bien, merci. Alors, can you answer the next one? 
étudier yeah. tes leçons with tu. Huh? I, I will conjugate it in imperative. First thing, we will cross the ER. Excellent. Then what I will put? Only one letter I put with tu. What is it? Mm. I put what? Repeat again. Mm. E. Très bien. I put letter E. So it will be étudie tes leçons. Study your lessons. Étudie tes leçons. It means study your lessons. Très bien. Excellent. Now I want uh, Jana Reed. Jana Reed. Yes, dear. Can I tell you something about the educate? No, after we finish the lesson, we will discuss the educates, okay? Because I want all your friends now to answer. No. Now, girls, uh, whose turn is it? Yes, uh, I want uh, Judy, Judy Ahmed. How are you, Judy? Comment ça va? Now, can you answer this one, Judy? Manger votre repas with vous. So, what is the first step, here, Judy? I will make what? Cross ER. Très bien, I will cross the ER. And with vous, which ending I put with vous? I put O and S, E or EZ? EZ. EZ, très bien. So, it will be manger votre repas. Eat your meal. Eat your meal or eat your food. It's eat your meal. Excellent. Bravo, Judy. Now, let's go to the next page here, to the next uh, number six. I want, I'll give another chance to Fatima. But Fatima, now we will uh, we'll answer correctly. Uh, Fatima Osama. Fatima Osama. Yeah. Yes, dear. Now, yeah. Roger, with tu. Angers with tu. Okay. Now, what two. I will make the first, first step? First cross R. Only R or ER? ER. Très bien. I cross the ER. Then what I will put? Yeah. Huh? Then I will put E. I put E. Excellent. Bravo. Range ta chambre. Arrange your room. I want you all today to go and arrange your rooms and don't forget to help your mom every day. Okay, now I want uh, Taqwa. It's Taqwa. Who is Taqwa? Yes, dear? Yes, teacher. What's your name? Salwa. You are Salwa? Okay, Salwa. You have to enter with your name, dear, next time, please. Now, restez à la maison. Stay at home. We are all staying at home. So how we will say it en français? Huh? What we will make? We will? We will cross ER. Très bien, excellent. Then? Huh? What I will put the ending with no? Uh, O N S. O N S. Excellent. Alors restons à la maison. Stay at home. Okay. Now I want now uh, Sultana. Yes, Sultana. Sultana. Okay. I'll choose another girl. It's okay. Najwa. Yes, teacher. Yes, dear. So I have here verb aller, and we said that verb aller is a regular verb or irregular. Mm. It will follow the rule, or it's it's, it's different. Hmm. Najwa, how how I will make verb aller with two. It will be what? Do mm. you know the answer? You were not paying attention. Okay, I will choose Joyria. Yes, Joyria. 
Yes, teacher. Yes, how are you, dear? I miss you. Tell me, verb aller is a regular or irregular? Regular. No, it's an irregular verb. Can you tell me verb aller with two? It will be what? Va. Va. So it changed. It's not aller anymore. This means that it's an irregular verb. Excellent. So it will be va at a plus. Go to your place. Excellent. Now, I want uh, Sultana. Sultana, are you paying attention, Sultana? Sultana? Yes, teacher. Yes, dear. Now, Ashte with Vu. What I will make the first step here? Cross ER. Yes, then what I put in place of, of the ER? ER? What I put in place of the ER? E. Yes? E. E only? With Vu, I put only E? Mm, remember, Sultana. Mm. Who is who is iPhone? Who who will who now? Who is, is raising her hand? Uh, yes, yes, dear. It's Bana. Yes, Bana. Can you answer this one after I cross the ER? What I will put? Easy. Easy. Très bien. Excellent. Girls, I want you to pay attention, please. Now, I want now, Rada. Rada, it's nice seeing you, Rada. Rada? Yes, yes dear. Yes. Now, tell me, Rada. Here, verb chanter. I, what is the first step I will make? Cross ER. Très bien. And what I will add? E. I will add E. Très bien. Bravo, Rada. So here, please write the two answers. Acheter here with EZ. And chante bien. Acheter des légumes means buy vegetables. And chante bien means sing well. Now, let's go to the next exercise. Écrit à la forme impérative. Now here, let me clear the board here from all the lines. And see now, I want those who didn't answer to raise their hands, please. I want uh, Salma. Salma Ronim, did you answer today? Yeah. Yes. Uh, Jana Faisal, did you answer? No. So, Jana Faisal, answer this one. Regardez, Ziad. Now, Ziad, I'm talking to one person or to more than one? One. Only one. So, what I will make the first step? Cross ER. Très bien. When I talk to one person, I add? Um, parle. Parle. No, regardez, regardez. So I will put only which letter I will put? E. E, très bien. E. So Ziad, regarde la télévision. Ziad, look at the TV. Merci. Now let's see number two. Dalia et Nadia. And who didn't answer today? Now... This is, uh, I will unmute all of you. Now, tell me girls, who did it answer I today? I am Jana Muhammad I don't yeah, answer. answer. Okay, Jana Eid. Okay, I, you will all participate, don't worry. Jana Eid, Dalia and Nadia. Oh, Jardin. Now, I'm talking now to one person or more than one? More than one. So, it means More it's, than one. Yes, more than one. So, here, I will put what? I cross the E-R and I put... Oh. Uh, what do you think? When I talk to one person, more than one person, I said I put what in place of the ER? Oh, it's it's oh, I put, I want only the one uh, that I'm talking to to answer. Yes. Jana, what I would put in place of the ER? ONT. ONT. ONT? No, I don't put ONT. No. When I talk, listen again, girls. When I talk to one person, add E. More than one person, easy. So again, one person I will add, okay. E. And more than one person I put? Easy. Easy, très bien. Et bien Dalia et Nadia, jouez au jardin. Dalia and Nadia, play in the garden. Merci, you can close your mind. Now, who else is, didn't answer today? Tell me your name. Now... 
Sultana. Sultana? Yes, teacher. Now tell me, Ryan or Metsa? Ryan to the doctor. I have telephone. So what, I'm talking to one person or more than one? Um, one person. One person. So I said with one person what I put. What I add with one person. E or easy? Easy. Easy? Oh la la. E -E -E. Oh, e -E. So it would be Ryan. Telephone. Oh, medicine. Yes. Call the doctor. Now, be careful here in this one. Amna et moi. Amna et moi means Amna and I. It means I am included now in the action. I am included now in the action. So who didn't answer girls today? You all answered? Me. Who? Oh, what's your name? Fatima? Who didn't answer? Is it Fatima? Yes. Yes, Fatima answers this one. Amna and moi means Amna and I. So I am included now with you. We said that I, can't I am included. When I am included with you. So it means that I will cross the ER and add what? I didn't answer. Okay, my dear, you will answer. Wait. Now, it means that I will cross the ER and add what, Ya Fatima? Fatima Muhammad? Fatima Muhammad? Can you answer this one? Okay, who else didn't answer? Tell me your name. Me. What's your name here? Judy. 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 Yes? It's Judy Aden? Yes, dear? Judy, tell me, Judy. When I say Amna et moi, it means I am included in the action with you. So what I will put at the end after crossing the ER? Uh, we will put uh, E. No, we won't put E. We put E when, I'm, when if it was only Amna, I will put E. If it was Amna e -Z. Fatima, it will be O-N-S. It will be, I'm sorry, it will be E-Z. If it was Amna and Fatima, Amna e Fatima, it will be E Z, but here Amna et moi and I. So when it's in, I am included in the action I put, I put what? Huh? Easy. No. I put. Uh, o N S. I put. O N S. In English, when you say uh, Amna and I, we went to school. So here also, Amna et moi means Amna and I. So when I have this one, et moi, it means I will put O and S. Circle it, girls. And right here, that Amna et moi means Amna and I. Did you write it? Circle et moi. And write that Amna et moi means Amna and I. And right above it, like this, like Madame Dina will do now. Here, right? No. Amna, em, em, when I find the word emoi, it means no. Is it clear? Is, is, is it clear? So what I will put? I will put O-N-S. Is it clear now? Parlons. Now, did you all answer now? Who didn't answer? What's your name, Gina? Teacher, I want to answer again. Wait, no, wait, no. Who didn't answer? Nadia. Not me. I answer. Please, Nadia. the one who didn't answer, tell me your name. Teacher, maybe not God. Who didn't answer? Najwa. Najwa didn't answer. Najwa? Najwa, you didn't answer? Yes, I didn't okay. answer. To ye, my lads, you are sick. Now we have verb aller. Verb aller with tu. Verb aller with tu. Now can you tell me the answer? Uh, verb aller with tu. What? Answer. Verb aller with tu. It will be. Come on, my dear. Answer. We are running out of time. It will be. Answer. 
it will be va. It will be va. 